I have to apologize to you. Ah, uh, I just got the chance to listen to Nasty again. I didn't hear it to me anything as to what it was. All I heard was you calling me a whore and all sorts of stuff and saying, Hey Kim, I like your pink tits. Why don't you come home? Because we share a family and we share a home. And not actually what this farm was. So I was really confused. So and then I realized what had just happened in this song. And I tried commenting again, but I blew up the first time and got booted off of writing comments for the next 18 hours. And, um, sat here screaming at me. A while. He told me to please re listen to the song. That I might be surprised. <laughs> or that I will be surprised. So I sat down and I re listened to it. And I've been crying for about 10 minutes now. I'm really sorry. I'm still insanely pissed. It's completely unforgivable the fact that you ever condone behavioral health for this stupidness or for any of that bullshit when you had me in public. I said that you could have spent time with me. And the fact that you could have allowed me to have a life, have a job, have a home. But instead, he wanted to have telemed visits or watch me under surveillance in the whatever. All over the place. Especially in behavioral health. The camera in my bedroom, the camera in my doctor's offices. That shit is unforgivable. It's completely unforgivable. My, li my living will and my last will and testament are staying the same. Completely. It's staying the same. Because it's what's necessary. I'm sorry, I'm taking so much away from everybody that we spent money on to record that are blowing up making more money off of their albums. Those albums that is the cheapest thing literally in the market that we make that we sell for the most expensive that people buy. You don't get to go and download free music off of YouTube. You don't get to do any of that stuff. People still buy the music. Maybe they're not paying YouTube subscriptions. Not everybody has the money to pay YouTube subscriptions. I most certainly don't. But besides that, I mean, come on. With what I've seen out of Kim and Haley, no thank you. As well as everybody else. In every way, no thank you. It's not an example that's properly set in America. It never was. That's not the American dream. Being gluttonous and stupid. Running around in hoochie goochie bullshit. That's not the American dream. The American dream was good health. 
happy home, good science, behavioral science, healthy religious communication, free-range political system, not communist program, not a degraded political system that runs based off of circumstantial what's the right word circumstantial hierarchy based off of the fact that you're bred out of something you are the best for the job even though you have no criteria or credentials because you're a rich kid you're the best for the job. And when you have no education credentials, you never did any homework. All you ever did was pay to get your homework done for you. Never passed the bar exam. Never did any of that stuff. Never once actually did a legal case. Never did anything ever once to represent any part of the natural American system. Obama. Joe Biden. Hillary Clinton. Bill Clinton. Bush was just a rich kid bastard. I'm not dishing but dishing Bush who wasn't that bad of a guy. Trump, fucking senile son of a bitch that's just a rich fucktard. Born and bred out of money. Never once gotten an education. He just sat and left his money go through stocks and shit and high yield savings, so he just grew. And he had money paid well enough to be able to set people up to hold on to it so they would grow. And we're in so much fucking debt. Seriously. And the fact that nobody gives a shit about anyone for common health or civilian life. Especially with the example your daughter has decided to show. On repeat. Because of her mother. Because of the fact that you're too. Too submissive to everybody around you that has always said, Well, she came out of your loin, which means she's God's blessing to you, and your your job and obligation is to please her every woman need. It wouldn't be happening that way in society if it wasn't right. And because of the fact that you let yourself dip down into cocaine with Kim. And you feel you're not strong enough to stand up and say, no one in every way that's bullshit. Instead, you decide to confiscate me by viewing me in behavioral health and making me not be able to stand up. Ever making it okay for them to be horribly evil to steal our food, to make us start death for two weeks, to make us go through the most insane problem. So that's why the statue is getting nothing but me buzz around it. And this one's getting fire. I do love you. I love you because I've loved you for so long. And I know what I'm sure you love me too. I don't know what
with the sear too. I've been there for me through a lot and done a lot too, but I don't expect to say I'm in love with a retard, so I must be a retard. <laughs>